Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my May favorites. I'm going to share the things I've been loving with you for the month of May, so let's get started. I wish I could have had a better video planned, but I'm very busy this week on my birthday. Let's start the things that I've been loving this month and we're going to start with planning and supplies. I love using planners, paper planners, and writing utensils and just like being physical with planning my life because it just helps me feel more um, motivated and organized. So I've been loving my planner, you guys know, for years. I love my planner. I got this one from Walmart. I love the Walmart planners, they're great. This brand is um, Blue Sky, especially. This brand from Walmart is my favorite. I have three of them. I use them all the time. Um, and then I also love highlighting. I use highlighters a lot. And the ones that I use are mid Zebra Midliner. They're double-ended. So it has a bold side and a sharp point. And this is this beautiful yellow that I got from a store. This one is in gold. So that's the bold side. Sharper point is like that. So really good highlighters. I've been using these highlighters for two years now. And I just love them. I do. I use them all the time. And I look at my planner so much, literally daily, to keep me <laughs> on track. So this is like what I do. I highlight. Pretty cool. So that's what I do. And I love these. I have gold, lemon. This is my favorite one. Lemon. So pretty. Blue, smoke blue, violet, and gray. These are my most used ones right now. I have the whole pack. There's like a like a 72 pack. I'm pretty sure that's the one I got and I love them. They're in my um, Harry Potter cup that's always sitting in the back corner. Okay, next we're going to go to beauty, skincare, all that because I have a lot of hygiene stuff that I want to show you that I've been loving over the last two months and I haven't really talked about them. I talked about a couple of them but not all of them so I'm going to share them. My favorite hygiene step to do after the shower is to when I dry myself off drench myself in body oil and my favorite body oils right now are the Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Body Oil Mist. This stuff is so good. It's so moisturizing. I love it. I just I feel so good when I wear it and it's just I found this on TikTok and I haven't looked back since. Next is my Vaseline Cocoa Butter. I use this one in the little container form at nighttime on my feet and I love it. And I did not know that they had a body oil so I picked up the body oil form. I just love this too. This is a really good one. It smells so good. I love the smell of this cocoa. I'm not really a big, big fan of smells and also I have really sensitive skin. So um, this scent is very faint and it works real well for my skin. So I am just obsessed obsessed with these two i do not mix these so i'll use this one day and then this one the other one never thought about mixing them but i probably wouldn't no don't do that and then every day every time after i put the body oil on i let it sit for like three minutes if, if it's still not dry i'm still gonna put body lotion on and this is the one that i use this is the sol de janeiro 59 this came out a couple months ago. I have been obsessed with this scent ever since. I have not raved about a lotion in so long. I'm obsessed with this. I use this every time after the shower. I bought a um, small one because they don't have the big size out yet. But once they came out with the big size, I had to get it. It is definitely worth your money. It's very thick and moisturizing. The scent is so beautiful. You can't even tell how much. But I just love it so much. Smells so good. The scent lasts two days. You guys, I'm not kidding you. It lasts two days on your body, especially when you have the body oil. So you need a body oil and this. Well, you def definitely don't need to add a body oil with this because it's that the scent lasts forever. Use body oil too. But, oh my God, I just can't get over the scent. And this is the Sol de Janeiro um, 59. But you know, I have to add in the fragrance also. I love it so much. I'm almost done with it. I'm at the point where when I put it all over my body, I also spray it on my bed. And then I spray it all all the all in the in the air in the room because I just love it so much. I love it. I can't get enough. I just can't get enough. And once I finish this one, I will be purchasing the refill. The best right now. I'm obsessed. Next on the list is the Sun Bum 3-in-1 Leave-In Conditioner. I use a like leave-in conditioner like detangler for my hair every day to brush my hair through. Um, and then I started using Sun Bum and I'm obsessed. It smells so good. It smells like bananas. 
it's a little bit pricey it's about 16 or 18 dollars but it is so worth it you only need two squirts in your hair and then you brush it and it's so good and it smells all day i'm obsessed i will forever be buying this i just can't get over the scent and it's just a summery beautiful on the beach you're laying on the beach scent and i love it i also love the sunscreen so if you have the sunscreen mmm it just smells so good okay so I just have a couple more things so this headband I bought on Amazon I've been looking at these because you know if you watch TikTok if you're a female you see these are so popular there's a brand called Versed and it seems like they've been advertising these for so long um but I wanted a yellow one and Amazon had it so this one is more this one is softer than the verse brand I'm not sure what brand it is but I will link it down below if you want this same one they have different colors but I wanted a yellow one because yellow makes me happy and it just fits like this it's so comfy it does not bother me at all so when you need to do your um, skincare after the shower or your makeup in the morning whenever it's perfect you don't have to put your hair in a ponytail although I well, even though I still do but it's just so perfect i was wearing this for like three hours the other day because i forgot that it was there i was laying in bed play monopoly go and i remember that i had this on and i was like oh let me just take this off but it is so cute so comfy does not hurt my head and i love it so i highly recommend this i'm pretty sure it was like no more than six dollars on amazon it's made out of this um like washcloth material so if you do get it stained obviously you can hand wash it off so okay Last but not least, highlighters. I have not been wearing highlighter in so long until recently. I used to be obsessed a couple years ago and I think I'm getting back into it because I found two highlighters that are so good. And the first one is the Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighter and this is in Sun Idol. This is the Glow Seeker highlighter and it's beautiful, so beautiful. This is literally the same as the Ambreezy highlighter. I've talked about it a few months ago, I believe. And the Ambreezy highlighter was discontinued because it was part of a collab. But this highlighter kept Anastasia, this makeup brand, alive for years. Like, that is the best highlighter ever in my life. And they finally came out with the highlighter in their own contract. So now we don't have to keep saving the Amrezy highlighter because the Amrezy highlighter is like six or seven years old I want to say. It's really not hygienic to, to keep it and use it but I'm going to. They finally came out with their own that will not get discontinued and I'm obsessed. I'm just obsessed. This is the one I have on right now. It's on my nose as you can see right there and right here. I just love putting it right there. It helps my face shine and just makes me look more glowy and I love it. So this is a little pricey. I think it might be $45 to $50. But if there is one highlighter you need to work, you need to spend your money on, it's this. And the next one is from Rare Beauty. This is Selena Gomez's brand. So, I love this one too. It's called Exhilarate. Made it in Italy. Okay, now for some reason I can't open it. Okay, here we go. She is beautiful. She is also beautiful. This is also a champagne highlighter i really like champagne highlighters because they fit my skin tone it's just like a golden champagne it's really pretty um compared to the anastasia this one is more pink and then this one is more like yellow tone. rare beauty anastasia rare beauty is more pink as you can see anastasia is more golden champagne and i love them both i just love a good champagne um, highlighter because it does fit my skin tone real well they're just so beautiful and they fit like every skin tone so I love these two and honestly I could throw all my highlighters away and just use these two so guys we have come to the end of this video unfortunately I hope you guys enjoyed hearing me talk about my favorite things this month and of course I will see you guys in my next video bye <laughs> Thank you.